Everything about working in the Congo is difficult. One of the things I realized uh, is that being over 30 years old, being over 40 years old, I need reading glasses. Uh, if I didn't have my reading glasses, I'd be devastated. So many people in this country can relate to that, can understand that. Uh, if you had to go for one day without your glasses, you wouldn't be able to read, you wouldn't be able to do fine-tuned work, whether it's screw something in. I mean, just think about how difficult your life would be without those glasses. This is the kind of thing that's often overlooked in, in a lot of conservation and development programs. A lot of development programs are designed in the West and implemented by Westerners. You ultimately need local people involved. With us, we don't want the local people involved in the programs. We want them to lead in the programs. They even lead in the design and the development of the programs. They give us ideas about what programs are needed. These people need to be able to function. Their, their social fabric needs to be stabilized. Uh, if they don't have an education, if they don't have food, if they don't have health care, uh, how can they be a full partner in anything? If they're worried about their child dying because they don't have some basic medicines, um, if they don't have the capacity to see and read clearly, then how can they function and how can they help us? Therefore, when I went in the first time I went to the Congo, I, I knew this, and I brought about 300 pairs of reading glasses. Uh, you can buy them for a dollar at the dollar store. One pair of glasses that you can purchase for a dollar at the dollar store can change someone's life. Yeah, we'd love to be able to bring in as many supplies and equipment as possible to help. Generators, electricity, cables, electrical cables, light bulbs. We always bring our own kitchen gear, pots and pans. We have to bring them in from Kinshasa, buy them in Kinshasa, ship them out. But all of these things are needed. It's, it's very difficult to work in the Congo. A pair of glasses for one dollar totally changes somebody's life. And they will wear them every day. They got these glasses because of a conservation program. They got these glasses because of bonobos.